You hear the term wind chill often in the cold months, or sometimes you hear it described as the feels like temperature. But how can you even measure how it feels outside? And what difference does it even make? Well, the wind chill describes the act of the wind taking away our body heat. And with absolutely no wind, the heat that radiates off our body lingers around us longer before cooling down to the temperature of the air around us. When there is wind, this process is accelerated and our body loses its heat buffer quicker. For this reason, only living things will experience wind chill. Now the corresponding wind chill value accounts for your body's heat loss for a more accurate feels like temperature. So wind chill values are calculated with a complicated equation, which is made easy to digest with this chart. So air temperature of negative 15, five mile per hour wind, wind chill is negative 28. If the wind speeds up to say 20 miles per hour, the wind chill is negative 42. The time in which frostbite can happen corresponds directly to wind chill. So at negative 42, frostbite would occur in 10 minutes to exposed skin. So that brings us to protection from the wind chill. Here are three rules to follow when it comes to layering your clothing. Number one, have warmth on the inside and a waterproof layer on the outside. Second, put on several loose layers. Each layer will trap air in between. Each layer of air acts to insulate your body heat. And last two, remember, give extra attention to your hands, feet, and head. And before you venture out in your layers, you can check the current temperature on the First Alert 5 weather app. In studio, meteorologist Alex O'Brien, News 5.